okay good day guys and welcome to today on princess anu tv this is the fourth day in our video challenge 30 days video challenge and today we are going to be talking about how to get free flight training stay tuned we'll be right back and today like we said we are going to be talking about how to get free flight training okay we've been talking about aviation 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 all the way our previous videos have been all about aviation and if you've not been following i would like you to check the description box click on the links even in the description box to follow our three previous videos so that you'll be ahead you know what i mean so that you can follow even in this video and if you've not subscribed yet to our tv channel make sure you click on the subscribe button because this tv channel is going to be keeping you inspired making you a better version of yourself and we're going to be giving you the right right resources <laughs> okay hello guys part of the ways you can get free flight training is to look for airlines that are looking for people to train airlines most of the time they bring out um scholarship boards like it's not just a scholarship like they, they organize uh what i call they organize like a cadet program this cadet program that they organize they invite people like they can invite like 50 to 60 people as in, I'm talking about the, the airline, they can invite like 50 to 60 people. When they come, they pass them through several interviews. And when you come for these interviews, if you're successful, they send you for flight training. They pay every single thing in there, just that you have to sign a bond after some time. That maybe if you come back, you're going to work with them for maybe like um, five years, six years, like that, like that. So these are the things that happen when you go to an airline. For them. Well, another place you can get free flight training is to look for a grant or a scholarship. A grant or a scholarship can help you also to get. It's like a free flight training because when you get a scholarship or a grant, you don't have to pay back. It's not like a loan that because you need to when you know all these differences. Not when someone is telling you, "Oh, come and get a loan," and you rush into it, and later when they're asking you to pay back, you don't know where to start from. No, that's not what we mean. If you want to get a grant or a scholarship, these are things that you don't have to pay back. Though, make sure you read the um, the conditions attached to this scholarship. Don't just jump into any scholarship or jump into any grant. Make sure you read it. So I know there are companies like most of the time UN, UNICEF, and uh, sometimes banks also go the extra length to give you this grant uh, or scholarships. So never lose hope. <laughs> i would like to talk about joining the military yes you might feel why would you say i should join the military because i want free flight training it's not a crime for you to decide to join the military because you want free flight training a lot of people join the military for several reasons some people even join the military just because they like their uniform imagine you that is even joining for a better good and someone that is just joining because they like the uniform who, who is going to be compared to i'm not saying outrightly okay this is the sole reason but a lot of people join the military because they just want to travel. People join the military oh because they just like the way they act. People join the military because they like how disciplined they are. So you joining the military because you want to have free flight training is not a crime. If you have your degree already and uh, you can you can join the short service and trust God that okay along the line maybe the Air Force they are going to take you for training. A lot of people have gotten that privilege. A lot of people have gotten that opportunity, and you also you can get that opportunity. So if you have your degree in your hand and you think you want to have the flight experience and you don't know how to do, it, you desperately need this. You can join the military even to get a free flight training. Also, okay, I'm going to be talking about. I'm not saying if you have a degree that means you can okay if, uh, you must have a degree before you go for flight training no i'm going to be making a different video on that whether you need a degree or you don't need a degree in order to become a pilot so just stay tuned um to this space so that as we post that's why i said you should click on the uh, bell so that whenever we post any of our videos you'll be able to see the fourth way you can also get free flight training is when the federal government sponsors you. Most of the time, just like the way the federal government has TED fund, PET fund, and all these things. Though, nowadays, in the 20, this, this uh, 2018, currently 2019, I don't think 
the federal government it has not been as rampant as as it used to be but once in a while they bring out openings that they used to sponsor people for this kind of uh you can also get free flight training from the federal government also your state if you get the admission like what we do here in NCAT, if you get the admission uh, after the f- uh, process of the evaluation and the rest you can ap- um, apply to your state government for sponsorship and if you're favored enough your state government can also sponsor you so don't feel oh because i don't have the money i can't do this there are several ways you can get which i just listed number one i've told you that airlines sponsor people just that you have to be prepared if you want to do this you have to be prepared at all times in order to meet the requirements so don't feel that oh because i don't have this because i don't have this that's why i cannot do it if you're if you're very prepared whenever the airlines call there was a time that brief to call people there was a time that like there are a lot of airlines that are calling people and it's people that are prepared they are going to call if you know you want to do this so that when you apply and they call you you will be ready enough to pass their evaluation exam so that they can sponsor you even for this training okay like i said i talked about airlines also i talked about getting grants and scholarships also i talked up i I talked also about federal government and state government you can put your attention on this um you can put your attention on this uh, parastatus so that you will be able to get a free flight journey. You know, this is Princess Anna TV. Like I always say, smile. Don't, for goodness sake, the whole world is not falling on you. And even if you feel the whole world is falling on you, it's not going to fall on just you. <laughs> there are several others in this world. So I need you to always smile. Happiness is a choice. I always say that happiness is a choice. You don't need the next person. If you hang your happiness on the next person, it's going to fail you because whenever the, that means whenever the person feels like getting angry, the person gets angry with you. And that's all. So happiness is a choice. Don't feel bad. Don't feel depressed. Just know that you can make it and your dreams too can come true. If mine could come true, yours too can come true. Stay tuned to this uh, channel. And if you've not subscribed, like I always say, make sure you click on the subscribe button so that whenever we post any of our videos, you'll be able to get it. Bye.